Hello everyone. I am Shigeru Ushida at the University of Tokyo in Japan. I am glad to present Teardrop Glasses, an eyeglasses style wearable device that can influence the emotion of multiple people. How do you feel when you see a person is crying? I believe many of you feel sad by seeing tears rolling down the cheeks. In this presentation, we introduce a method for influencing the emotion of multiple people through artificial bodily changes, such as the tears. Psychological studies in emotion have revealed that our minds and our bodies are related. American psychologist William James Best expressed this notion. We feel sorry because we cry, angry because we strike, afraid because we tremble. This means that not only our emotions trigger our bodily changes, but also our bodily changes trigger our emotions. On the other hand, emotional contagion is a phenomenon in which emotion is unconsciously and instantly transmitted among people. Emotional contagion occurs by observing another person's bodily changes or emotional expressions. Then, this fact led us to an idea that we may be able to induce specific emotions of people by making them believe that they are experiencing specific bodily changes. In this study, we focused on shedding tears as a bodily change due to the relations between tears and emotions. Then, instead of enforcing actual bodily change to people, we artificially generated a suitable bodily change such as the tears. We develop a device that can place water drops near the inner corners of the wearer's eyes to imitate tear drops. The flow of water can be remotely controlled via infrared communication. A syringe is used to store and refill the water. Two springs fitted on the left side of the device pushes the syringe. When the electromagnetic bulb opens, the spring pressure is released and the water within the syringe flows into the region near the inner corner of the user's eyes. We employ this motor-free mechanism for the sake of the lightness and quietness of the device. The water from the syringe goes to two tubes that are located near the inner corners of the user's eyes. We conducted an experiment to confirm our assumption of artificially generated water changes to induce emotional contagion. In this experiment, the participant group was asked to watch a 10-minute slide show consisted of neutral visual stimuli. Each group watched three different slide shows with different three conditions, including control condition, in which the participants watched the slide show without the device, glasses without tears condition, in which one of the participants wore the device, but no water came out from the device, and finally, glasses with tears condition, in which one of the participants wore the glasses and water drop every 25 seconds. We measure the subjective rating of sadness and happiness through a self-inventory questionnaire with dummy questions. Moreover, we estimate the positive and negative score of each participant through the analysis of tekis gathered from the participants as impressions of the slideshow. The tekis were obtained after watching each slideshow. These are the results of the sadness and happiness rating of the participants. Each rating was corrected by subtracting the ratings in control condition to simply compare the effect of the pseudo tears. A significant difference is found in the sadness rating between with and without tears condition. The differences are found both for wearers and non wearers. This means that pseudo tears successfully influence the sadness feeling of both wearers and non wearers. In contrast, only the happiness rating of non wearers has a significant difference between with and without tears condition. There is no significant difference in wearers. Also, the positive and negative score under with tears condition in non wearers was lower than the other conditions. However, no influence was found in wearers. Comments from some wearers indicated that the presentation of tears caused them to feel good. It seems that the tears also have an effect on stress relief. We believe that such an effect of tears might influence the feeling of the wearers and cause differences in the feeling of between the wearers and non wearers. Our findings can be applied to enhance subjective variety through the direct inducement of emotions, such as cry track in the same manner as a laugh track, or enhancing sadness or an impressive situation while watching movies at home. Or it might be useful for promoting mental and social health in group therapy regulating the emotions of participants with emotional contagion triggered by a therapy through the emotional expression. These are the summaries of my talk. Thank you.